everyone and welcome to my channel I'm Cassandra today I have a review a review on a fragrance by Roberto Carvalho so if you want to see exactly which fragrance I have please continue to watch Okay, I know y'all are going to ask me something about this shirt, but it's not a shirt, it's a dress. And it says, it's my birthday weekend. Yes, my birthday is coming up, y'all. And this is the weekend before my birthday. Really, I'm celebrating the whole month of August. So I got in a Leo slash Virgos in the house. Y'all come on and get it get it on because we celebrate the whole month at least I do because I'm a Virgo I celebrate the whole month of August okay so other than that let's go ahead on and talk about this fragrance okay and this is the packaging for Roberto Cavalli and the fragrance is Gimme the Paradisco. Anyway, this is a 2.5 full ounce, 75 milliliters EDP. I love the packaging with the ombre colors, how it going up into the gold. This is gorgeous. I really do love the packaging. Okay. And this, and I also like the fact that he got his initial here too. That's gorgeous too. Okay. Now this is the bottle. Gorgeous. This is a gorgeous bottle. Gorgeous. How it starts with the dark um, teal. I would call it teal. It's a bluish green. And it goes up and get lighter, lighter, lighter. This is gorgeous, y'all. And then in the top, it has the initials of the company. Let's see, can y'all see that? Probably can't see it. But I'm going to um, have a picture up here somewhere to let you all see it, okay? Y'all have been wearing this fragrance. I bought it for my birthday. But I'm going to tell you, I've been wearing this fragrance. And I would like to have a shout out to say a shout out to Amber Chantel. I think that's how she pronounced her name, but I have her name up here somewhere. She was the one that was talking about this fragrance. And I love the way she talked about it, how she loved it and stuff like that. I said, I got to get it. And I'm glad I did. So let's go ahead on with this review. Okay. Okay. Let's spray. Yeah. This fragrance was released in 2018. So it's still a young baby. It's just two years old. But the scent mm, in this one, I smell oranges, jasmine, vanilla, musk. Oh, I smell the amber in this, y'all. Mm, and I think it's a and it smells kind of woody too. I mean, this is a sexy oriental floral fragrance. Do I need to say it again? Sexy oriental floral fragrance. Amber, you was right. I love this fragrance. Mm. 
Mm. Mm. Oh, this scent is smooth. It's sweet. Not overly sweet, but it is sweet. And it's creamy with the dry down. It is creamy, y'all. Like I said, when I first spray this, I smell oranges. Maybe even pears in it. But I definitely smell the orange. Citrus. And then that vanilla get with the, with that fruit. Mm, mm, mm. That's what making it smell sweet. But it's not an over sweetness. And then here comes my Jasmine, y'all. Jasmine, she just come on in there. There she come, y'all. Look out, here come Jasmine. Mm. Jasmine come in, and she said, y'all, I am here. And she is here. So my Jasmine just take over. She just take over. And that's what I like about this fragrance. Because I love me some jasmine. Where have I been, y'all? This is an underrated fragrance. I mean, where have I been? I'm glad I was watching Amber, Amber Chatel um, video. Because I would have never got this. Now, when it dries down, to me, it kind of smells... Like it got some coconut or something in it. But um, it's kind of smell like. Let's see. I had some. Yeah. Here it is. Let's try this bum bum cream. Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah, it reminds me of the bonbon bon cream. Yeah. Yeah. This is gorgeous, y'all. Simply gorgeous. Mm. Now, now, this fragrance, I wouldn't wear in the hot, hot season. I definitely wear it in the winter, spring season. But not the summertime when it's really hot. I wouldn't wear it then. But this is, y'all, this is a gorgeous scent. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. And like I say, it does just a little. Reminds me of uh, Soul de Janeiro, this bum bum cream. But not so much as um, because it has the coconutty type smell to it and this one really don't but it's gorgeous now the siage on this is moderate the longevity of this is six plus hours but um if you add some bum bum cream or something it lasts longer but when i do um uh, Put it on my clothes as well as on my body it does last a little longer mm. y'all this is a gorgeous scent i'm glad i purchased it mm, mm, mm. gorgeous let's go ahead on and rate this fragrance on a scale from one to five the packaging i would give this packaging a four on a scale for one to five, the bottle, I would give it a five. On a scale from one to five, the juice inside this bottle, I would give it a 4.5. The sillage and the longevity of this fragrance, I would give it a four. So my overall number for this fragrance is a 4.5 gorgeous simply gorgeous 
So that's it for this video. Please comment in the bottom section of this video and let me know, do you have this fragrance? What do you think about it? Other than that, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. I'll see you all next time. Bye-bye.